Monday night, Betty was here. <laughs> and we sent her out to a swanky restaurant. She, wasn't she wearing the same thing? Anyway. <laughs> we sent her out to a swanky restaurant uh, called Craig's. And th we thought we'd follow up and see how that went. <laughs> Hello, Betty. Welcome back. Hi, thank you. Hi. So, <laughs> so how was your meal? Oh, <laughs> very good. Oh, that's very good. So, Betty, are you? Are, do you have any dietary uh, requirements? Are you a vegetarian? Do you eat a lot of the uh, vegan food, anything like that? Uh, no gluten. No gluten. Right. What is that? <laughs> what, what is gluten? Uh, it's wheat. Wheat. Yeah. So what you're saying is you hate the farmers of America. <laughs> I'm just trying to get clear on where you stand with this. Yeah, no, I'm kidding. Uh, but that's the kind of thing they do to you on television, you know. Yeah. Really? They, they make things up and they try and get you to say them. He's been doing it to me for years. <laughs> you know. Have you ever been on a TV show before? No. Well, you were here Monday. <laughs> but I don't know Was that... Was that Monday? Yeah, it seems... <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, what you doing for the weekend, Betty? What's going on? Not much. I'm to have my kids in and we're yeah. visiting. Do you get along with your kids? Very much. Very good. Because they live in Oregon. Because they live in Oregon, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Do you have any pets? No. You should have a cat. I used to have a dog. Well, that doesn't mean you still have a dog. I don't have a dog. It's time you had a cat. I think a cat can't be good for you, Betty. Really? I don't know. Yes. Yes, you want to have a cat and then you can teach it and make it wear little jackets. <laughs> Which, what should we talk about now? <laughs> I don't know, Betty. <laughs> and that's why I'm not very good at this job. Oh, I think you're very good at this job. Thanks, Betty. <laughs> I don't even think it's a job. <laughs> well, you make it fun for everybody. Not everybody. Oh, I think everybody. No, no, him over there. I try and make his life hell. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, we'll be right back with the Big Friday Night Show, everybody. We'll be right back. of Zyrtec. Zyrtec. Model no more. Near. Yeah, it's right near there. It's right above it. It's All right. Above. Oh, uh, in California? Because the other one was in New York. That's fine. Okay. <laughs> uh, Ava says, uh, Craig, my sister says kale is yesterday's news and wants me to eat maca powder. Do you know anything about this? I don't even know you. Maca powder. Sister, hey. why are you gone? No. Anyway, who says kale is just the news? Kale's the new in thing. Jeff and I swear by it. Look how thin he is. Yeah, man, why don't you rub a little maca powder on your wicked, the wicked, the cut the You're all right. This is from Alex in, uh, Alexi in Granby, Connecticut, who says, uh, oh, Connecticut. Uh, Connecticut, yes. Uh, hello, yes. Uh, Connecticut. Uh. Alexi says, uh, Craig, why is that woman who says my name with a Spanish accent, why is it that a woman who says my name with a Spanish accent seems so sexy to me? Because you're a pervert. <laughs> and a racist. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I just 
kidding with you, Alexi. <laughs> Is that a Spanish accent? Oh, you're so sexy, Alex. Oh, I think the Alex. Oh, ay, ay, ay. Crikey. You want from me? I'm Scotty. Yeah, man. And finally, this is from Joel in Redondo Beach in California. Now, I don't know if you can tell, this photograph's not very clear, but he's, uh, seems like Joel is some kind of hippopotamus. Oh, yeah. yeah. Or, 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 he could be the bird that's uh, atop the hippopotamus. <laughs> Either way, he's from. Either way, he's from Redondo Beach, California. That's right, Redondo. All right, Redondo. You ever been there? Sure, sure. Good place. Nice water down there. Isn't that where the sewer pipe goes? Yeah, sure. There? Yeah, it's nice. Yeah, it's. Uh, Joel uh, says, uh, Craig, we're having some people over for game night on Saturday at eight. Are you and Jeff interested in coming over? Are you interested in going? No, no, no. I mean, we'd like to, but then, then. Ah, ah, nah. I mean, do you do you wanna? I mean, we. Uh, nah. I mean, I think we've got something on on Saturday. I can't remember what it is. Do you remember? Uh, it's, it's, but I, I can't remember. I wish if only someone would, you know. Uh, oh, oh, hey, what? Wait a minute. Did the audience just go? Oh, oh, hey. That warms my heart. Yeah, it's still ringing. Good. Hello. Hello, Craig. It's Serge. How are you? Oh, Serge. How are you doing? What, what are you again? Yeah, I'm your friend. Uh, let me see if I can remember. Um, I think I ran a cheesesteak uh, place. Or oh, yes, that's right. You run a cheesesteak place in Philly, but you're originally from some sort of effete. Yeah. Um, it's going to help a bit, really, if we paint this out, I think, before. Um... <laughs> I'm still here. <laughs> yeah. But I'm not. We'll be right back. <laughs> I'm gonna stop leering when they walk away. I'm like, <laughs> my first guest tonight is a very beautiful actress. Her movie, The Single Moms Club, opens March the 14th. Our show, Justified, is on Tuesdays on FX. Take a look at this. What kind of moves work best on Raylan? Are you joking right now? Because if you're not, I, I gotta say, you sound like you just stepped out of Bad Country song. I've gotta come take my man. Funny thing, though, those are the songs that just get stuck in your head. Uh, earworms, I think is what they call them. Okay, so you're serious then. Well, let me tell you, I don't foresee you learning anything more intimate about Raylan than you already have. Sorry you wasted your time. The beautiful Amy Smart! I mean, wow, look at you. You look amazing. Yo, I wanted a sparkle for you. Well, you, you, for me? Yes. I can't, I can't, can't possibly accept, but I'd love to. <laughs> it's very, <laughs> it's very sparkly. It's, is that, is that vintage? It's not. It's made to look vintage. Though. Well, you know what? It's very authentic looking. <laughs> Thank you. I'm going to go with that. Yeah, it looks amazing. And good shoes, nice Thank choice, you. open toe. I, I like your socks. Thanks, I, I wore them the night Ashton Kutcher was here as well. Did you? Uh... <laughs> you, you don't do laundry very much. Yeah, no. do you? Well, you know, I cleaned them uh, after. Yeah, because yeah, you were meant to be here that night, remember? And I then know. We, I limboed, and then you were really mad at me, and you slapped me really hard and pulled my hair. Nice to. I'm sorry, I'm healed. going way too far with that. You the... healed. What? The red spot's gone. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Thank you. Are you mad at me? A little bit? You know, you picked Ashton over me. I'm a little. I know. Jealous. No, 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 no. I didn't. I did not pick him over you. I. He just got talking, and I, you know, I got lost in his eyes. They're dreamy. <laughs> I see which way you sway now. Yeah. No, you don't. Yeah. <laughs> 
are things with you? How are things mm -hmm. with, uh, where is it you live again? Topanga, isn't it? I grew up in Topanga. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Before, How are things? You eat a lot of kale out there, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> I do eat a lot of kale. Do you eat a lot of kale? It's good for you. Uh, yeah, I, I think I eat. So my wife puts this weird green substance near the food and makes me eat it. I'm guessing that's what it is. Did you ever put it in a smoothie? I, I don't have smoothies. You don't? No. It's a good place to hide. No, I don't like smoothies. Why? You're They're un American. <laughs> I don't know why. No, I don't. I used to drink smoothies, but aren't they like millions of calories and you don't know what's going in? There's like. If you put like a lot of ice cream in it or something, but. No. Well, that's the only way I would want to have one, though. <laughs> Take away the taste of the kale. Do you eat. eat you I clearly don't have a lot of high calorie. I I, mean, I do it all. I mean, I eat everything, but I do do smoothies because you could put like a lot of frozen fruit, hide the kale. Right. Because, you know. It's not that nice. It's okay, but, you know. Yeah, it tastes like. It's good like, for you, but you. It tastes like rocket. Fun yeah, yeah, I know. <laughs> it does. I, I think it does. Uh, I'm allowed to say that. It's America. I can say. I can't say that? <laughs> You're a racist, man. I, are you still at the, the, the bending stretching? Yeah, yeah. I actually took a, a, a level two yoga teacher's training this weekend. And? Did you and pass? And reminded well, it's a three, it's three weekends in a row, so oh, right. I still have two more weekends to go, but it was I, for mind and meditation. So my meditative yoga? Uh, it was, well, there is, you know, in yoga, the, you do do yoga to help meditate. Well, yoga means union, doesn't help. it? Mind and, uh, yeah, so. Uh, so, and then it helps your mind. Right. Do you, are you suggesting I need to do some? It could help. Okay, I'll do some. You want to? I've got meditating music here. Watch this. Dude, that helps you meditate, doesn't it? That's the face you make. <laughs> Sorry, I was doing something else. So yeah, that, yeah, that. He looks well, like okay. Let's take the you through some meditation then. Let's do some. Okay. All right, you're a teacher, go. Well, I can't cross my leg. I mean, I can't go in cross-legged position. Okay, we'll let that slide. All right. <laughs> so you can put your hands on your lap. All right. Set your thumbs to your index fingers. Uh, okay. It's called Gyan Mudra. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. We're going to close our eyes. You're going to focus at your third eye point. And you're going... <laughs> You're going to take some deep breaths, and you're going to watch your thoughts. <laughs> watch them, Craig. It's like watching porn if I watch my thoughts. Okay. Right. Okay, I'm watching them. Are they still coming? Yeah. <laughs> is doing it too. Isn't that cute? Look. <laughs> and Jeff. Jeff's doing it too. Look, he's turned his eyes out. <laughs> All right, come on. What's next? Okay. When's the tickly bit? <laughs> is that, that's no, we don't, we don't do the tickle bit. That's it then? You just do that for a while? For a while. <laughs> I really like that movie you did. Thank you. Uh, the, uh, <laughs> The Single Moms Club, yeah, it, uh, no, but uh, it's about, uh, what's it about? The Single well, Moms Club. I don't know. It's, I can't it's think single moms. Is, is, and it's all about single moms. Going, they go crazy on a crime spree? That would be pretty interesting. Yes. No. Oh. It's basically about these five moms that come together. Their kids all go to private school. They're about to be expelled because the kids are all, all acted up and were bad. So the moms have to come together and throw a fundraiser at the school. And every mom happens to be single. And they form the Single Moms Club, and they become really supportive and start dating. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When's the robot coming in, or the, uh, <laughs> or the, or the killer, or the, uh, you know, when do people start? There's lovers that come in. Okay, right? that's good. That's good. It's yeah, that's a comedy. It's not a. It's a comedy. It's a comedy. It's a comedy. It's a comedy that women would enjoy. And men. Sure. A lot of fun men in there too. And men. Yeah. Take your wife to see this. You bet I will. Good. Um, she'll be like, no, I want to see RoboCop. I'm like, get in the car, bitch. We're going to see Single Mom. Hell yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we have to take a break. Okay. From each other. Fine, I'll have a sip from this mug. Uh, okay, I'll have a sip from this bigger, more flamboyant mug. <laughs>
We'll be right back with Eric Carter. Welcome back, everybody. I'm talking to Andy Smart about Single Moms Club. She got a little mad at me because she thought I was a little bit disrespectful about the movie, but I wasn't. I. It's a great movie. Yeah. It's funny. It's totally. It's funny. got. It's got really funny, uh, sexually attractive women in it. That works for me. Oh, good. Then go I find you. funny women very uh, sexually attractive. You do. I do. I'm very attracted to a sense of humor. So, which women? Uh, let's see. Julia Louis Dreyfus, very funny. Yeah. Very attractive. Lucille Ball. Hot as hell. hell. No, really. I mean, Lucio Ball, you know, she was like yeah. six foot tall, redhead, funny, smoking hot body. I mean, obviously it was a while ago, but still, you know. Right. Yeah. That's a good one to call on. Why? Because <laughs> she's dead. I mean. Because she, she's I mean, because dead? she's dead to you. Well, she's dead to everybody. God bless <laughs> She's not even an option. Why do you hate Lucille so much, Amy? She's so funny. No, no, she, I do. No, I she find was it. amazing. She was amazing. Yeah, she was amazing. Yeah. Are you attracted to men with a sense of humor? Or do Absolutely. You like See, women always say that. No. Then... No, I mean it. Yeah, you do? I do. Yeah. It's what kind of sense? Best, uh, well, I'm not going to start naming people, though. Well, you made me do it. I know, but I'm not going to do it. Well, I'm not going to do it either once the edit comes in. Okay, fun. <laughs> Now. Yeah. Um, so we're also starting a winery, my husband and I. You're starting a winery? We are. Are you an alcoholic? <laughs> no. That's why we're starting. That's why you can start yeah. a winery. Yeah, of course. <laughs> what, are you going yeah. to sell wine? Yeah. To hobos or fancy folks? Hopefully a little of everything. Okay. That's yeah. good. So you're making low-grade, <laughs> super high alcoholic content wine to sell to vagrants. That's High mean. grade, no. No, you're making nice wine? No, we're making nice wine. Where is um, your it's vineyard? It's Traverse City, Michigan. Michigan, the home yeah. of wine. Oh, nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. Michigan wine is some of the best in, in the world. Don't laugh. It's what? Really, it's <laughs> it oh, he's like, <laughs> it's enough. Okay. All right, uh, we got to stop. Yeah. Okay, fine. Yeah. Never mind. So uh, you, you, you... It's called Bonobo. And I want you to research that. Well, it's a monkey's name. It is. Oh, you know. I do. It's a nice, gentle monkey. They're lovers, not fighters. Right. They're gentle monkeys. That they have sex a lot. They do? Yeah. It's your new favorite monkey, isn't it? It's always been my favorite monkey. <laughs> we gotta go. Bye-bye. All right. Amy Spire, everybody. Bye -bye. I just bought the old Lindbergh house next door. Um, hi. You said hi already. Tell him you'll untie your tubes for a man who's fiscally responsible. Listen, I'm a contractor by day, so if it ever gets loud, just let me know. Tell him you like it loud. Shut up. Look down at his zipper. Look at his crotch. Is he happy to see you? I bet he is. Huh. Tell him you <laughs> want it. <laughs> 